Hello and welcome. Brand new adventure for you. This time traveling to Chicago's Blues Fest. I'm not going to do too much commentary. Just going to let the footage speak for itself. I'm filming first person perspective with the Yi camera and taking pictures with the Sony NEX F3. So join me from beginning to end and I'll put in the photos that I got randomly as I go along. So filming and taking pictures is a difficult task. So there's more footage than pictures this time. I hope every one of you is doing well and t thank you for uh, taking the time to check out the videos that I posted as far as the live performances from this occasion. It was a good experience and overall the pictures that I did manage to get were good. So let's go along and if there's something I need to explain, I'll just interject and I'll put in uh, some commentary for that. But for the most part, uh, just enjoy the trip and I'll see you in a little bit. Bye. Here is the main entrance to Millennium Park and I'm headed towards the main stage. So in a little bit you're going to get to see how many people are there.
to make a long story short. So heading inside the Mississippi juke joint and here was a little difficult to mess with my settings because it was dark inside uh, as opposed to being on the outside with all the sun so I had to adjust really quickly and uh, since I'm not familiar with the specific camera it took me a little while but here's the footage anyhow. I'm 
this advertisement. I came across this advertisement, and uh, kind of shook me to my to my core. It was a advertisement for a young woman in the late 1700s, and they were very common because you know when you get some cash, you sold somebody. That was just the way it was. Pretty horrible. But the thing that killed me the most about this ad is that at the bottom of it it said for a young woman. So she has with her a nine-month-old baby who is at the first of her option. And I just, like, as a mother, that just really went straight to my heart. So I just thought about that young woman and what she had to live through every morning, every afternoon, every evening, and every day. And uh, this song came out. It's called The First of Option. Okay, so I'm holding the camera about chest level as I'm walking through and now I'm starting to head back once I decided to take off because it would have been really crowded if I would have left uh, later in the evening. So the sun's starting to go down 
and what you're going to see is walking on the opposite end um, as I'm going along I'm trying to take pictures at the same time but the sun is flaring right in my face and I'm trying to hold the camera the, the one I'm shooting film with and uh, it was just not happening uh, the way I'm normally used to so uh, thanks for a lot for sticking around through the whole video this is a long one uh, so if you made it this far thank you very much uh, if you're new to the channel uh, subscribe because I do a video once a week um, mainly for my photography uh, and then some live music stuff so thanks again and uh, leave me your comments and your thoughts uh, let me know if you were at this festival um, if you liked it uh, what bands did you see or if you filmed anything from the festival um, that you want to share with me I'd like to check it out alright thanks